I'm Dave Warren. It has to happen sooner or later. 90 degrees typically early April. It has happened as uh, soon as March 2nd and looks like we're getting closer here. Not quite today. You got a few more degrees to go here. 80 will be up to about 82 to 83. Then that nice east breeze comes in levels off. Our temperatures will hover in the mid 70s here overnight tonight. Mainly dry, just a few passing clouds. That's our visible satellite picture here. The temperatures they're coming in at or just above 80 everywhere. So a warm day, warm at the uh, forecast here. Uh, now it does get even warmer. Uh, that high pressure area moves away. You get more heat coming in, a little more humid, and that's what we can expect Friday, Saturday, even Sunday. We're stretching this out here by Sunday. Uh, there's a little bit of moisture that starts to work its way into the area, so we could see a few showers around. Monday could be the day where we hit 90 because we're not seeing much change in this. But this will change our weather Monday night as this gets a little closer. Showers develop and then we'll get some relief Tuesday to Wednesday. Temperatures drop, the humidity drops. It's after we're near record or record tying temperatures there. 88 to 90 Sunday to Monday. Then the front drops our temperatures back to the average line there. 80 and we'll be right about there Tuesday and Wednesday. Lower 80s here this afternoon. We're almost there. We'll keep it right about there till about 5, 7 o'clock tonight. Partly cloudy skies. Then we drop into the mid 70s here this evening. Extended forecast. Uh, we're looking at the heat coming in over the weekend there Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Temperatures climb into the upper 80s. Hitting 90 on Monday as that southwest breeze turns northwest. Now, Tuesday is the first day of spring, so we will welcome that with some slightly lower humidity, the slightly cooler temperatures. We'll dry things out here after the showers come in Sunday to Monday. The shower chances go down Tuesday and Wednesday as our lows drop into the upper 60s.